hey guys it's pacifiers and rollers here welcome back to my channel today i will be showing you a quick video on how i got this cute protective style for the week so to start off i am washing my hair because this is a two week old twist out that i had and my hair was like super dry it was rainy for the week so i couldn't really do much because my hair and moisture do not mix my hair generally gets really frizzy when it rains so i usually try to do like a nice either protective style or puff to maintain my hair for the week shampoo that i will be using is the tara amour powerhouse shampoo and i really love this shampoo because it lathers really well i do not have to use too much shampoo to get a good lather on my hair so i'm just gonna work this in from the scalp and down to the ends and I usually use a raking method to move the product from scalp to tip. So after rinsing out this shampoo, I used the Mayo by She Scented to just condition my hair really quickly and do a little bit of detangling. And then I'm just going to rinse this product out and then we're going to style. So I'm starting off with the J. Antoinette Hydrotherapy Mist just to moisturize my hair. And then I'm going to begin parting off the sections on the left side just so that I can do a little rubber band style on the side. The products that I'm using are my Beauty From The Roots, Define Me Please Hair Pudding, and Coconut Oil. is very tangly so yes I have to detangle and then I'm just going to section off these um, parts add some edge control and I am using the edge effect edge control just to kind of make sure all my little strands are nice and slick in the rubber band and for this rubber band method I am parting off and then as I move each strand to the next rubber band I'm doing a twist along the way This can be very tedious, so I'm just going to skip through after adding this rubber band and taking a little bit out of my edges out. I'm just going to show you the final result. So I have a half side rubber band style, which I'm going to add some jewelry to later on down the line. So for the remainder of this video, I am going to do a two strand twist on the remainder of my hair that is out right now. I generally do a twad as they call it because when I twist my hair I usually really like the finishing in the beginning and when I do a twad it allows me to have three sections of two strand twist which allow me to keep definition and prevent me from opening my hair as much as I would with this two strand twist and I'll come back to you guys when I have all of this completed. So after I twisted all of my hair, I am using J. Antoinette's Moisture Repair Elixir just to oil my scalp and to make sure that it is shiny, it is moisturized and not dry throughout the week. And then I'm going to twist up the back of my hair and just pin it up by crossing each section by two strands, one over the other, just to pull it up and pin it back. And as you can see, I added some hair jewelry and silver on the side. And then I'm going to wear this out for a couple of days before I take down my two strand twist. So 
so this is about three to four days later i took down my two strand twists i did not open up my strands too much just because i wanted to keep definition and i am really loving this twist out so if you have not already i would definitely suggest j antoinette products as well as beauty from the roots use my code pnr for beauty from the roots and pnr15 for j antoinette so I hope you love this video and love this twist out just as much as I do. Please don't forget to leave a comment. And if you want to see more, follow me on IG at Pacifies and Rollers.